Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video we are going to solve the 16th question from CBSC class 10, 2023-24. Sample question paper set 2 for mathematics standard with subject code 041. Section A which is multiple choice questions where each question is of one mark. Now this question is from pair of linear equations in two variables chapter. Two linear equations in variables x and y are given below. Which of the following pieces of information is independently sufficient to determine if a solution exists or not for this pair of linear equations. Now we can see there are four given options. So we have to choose which of the option is a right fit for the given two lines. So to solve this we need to know the condition for intersecting lines, coincident lines and parallel lines. So let me begin by writing the conditions first. So these are the three conditions that is for coincident lines for intersecting lines and for the parallel lines. Now let us try to write the coefficients of the line 1 and line 2 in the form of proportion as it is given in the three conditions. So here it is going to be a1 over a2 and b1 over b2 and c1 over c2 you can see the c is same. So c1 is going to be c over c2 is going to be c. Now we can easily divide the c from each other so c1 times and c1 times and we can replace this c over c by 1. So we can say that a1 over a2 is equal to b1 over b2 is equal to c1 over c2 which is 1. And this kind of condition resembles the coincident lines that is a1 over a2 equal to b1 over b2 is equal to c1 over c2. And since this represents our coincident lines, we can say that the first option can be considered. And if you look carefully, here they have just exchanged the places of b1 and a2. So if you bring a2 here, it becomes a1 over a2 as it is there in the condition. And if we take b1 over here, it becomes b1 over b2. Now let us look at the second given option. a1 over a2 is equal to b1 over b2. Now if we look at all the three conditions, we do not have any condition which represents this second given option. So the second is not our answer. Now let us look at the third option. It is a1 over a2 is equal to a1 over b1. But here we have got as b1 over b2. So the third option is clearly a wrong one. Now if we look at the fourth option, it is a1 over a2 is not equal to b1 over b2. Here we had assumed that a1 over a2 may be equal to b1 over b2. So it might be possible that a1 over a2 is not equal to b1 over b2 and it represents our intersecting lines which is one of the conditions given here. So we can say that we can also consider the option 4 as an independent sufficient information to find out if a solution exists or not. So here in the option we can say option 1 and 4 which is b. So in this question you have to only know the conditions of the lines you have studied that is coincident lines, intersecting lines and parallel lines and looking at these conditions you have to choose the best option which fits the given two lines. I hope you have understood all the steps and like the video. If you know any other way of solving this example do comment below and if you are liking my videos like share and subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching. 